Vlogmas day three. I gotta make Harper's school lunch. Please hold. Let me get the supplies out the refrigerator because uh, it's almost time for Harper's school. I was saying, anyway, she likes print. Probably can't even remember. Some of I don't have to like. Um, where's the bread I bought? Because I definitely Did ShopRite not bring me my bread the other day? Because if so, that's janky as hell. Because I ordered bread and I ordered croissants. And I see. What? Come here, Enzo. What? Come here, Enzo. Why does he have lotion? There's no bread in the house. Please hold. I'll be right back. All right. First of all, my cart is drunk. My cart is drunk. We made it to the supermarket to get some bread. No, I'm not taking my sunglasses off because it's too early. But, this the bread aisle? No, this is the bread aisle. This one is the bread aisle right here. Good morning. Right, it's loud. I came for bread, croissants, and I'm getting some chocolate pancakes. And I'll meet you guys back at home. Daily vlogging, showing you everything I do in a day. This was not in my plans, but here we are. You know, this is what happens as a mom. You go to make your kid a sandwich for lunch, and there ain't no bread. Shop right, count your days. Count your days, shop right. So I walked out the supermarket and I went into the dollar store. Cause well, let me see if I could. Is that a better angle? I don't know. I went into the dollar store because remember I told you guys I needed like a couple things. Well, I went. I thought the dollar store was cheap. I got like literally two bags. One bag has one thing in it though. I got like five, six things, and my total was forty-three dollars. I thought I was going. To, I thought I was going to spend twenty dollars. What? What? <laughs> boom, 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 boom. All right, so I'm back in the market. Uh, I'm actually gonna put you guys back in the cup holder because I like how high it is when it's in the cup holder. That's my thing. Why is Enzo playing with the broom? This kid, I think he's like adamant about like this one day. It's like making me just go crazy. Hold on, let me see. Let me see what y'all internet nephew was doing because he's driving me crazy. Um, but yeah, so I got back from the market. I ended up going into the dollar store as well. Got some bread, needed diet. Um, got some chocolate pancakes for the guy. Enzo, I'm gonna buy you a little broom for Christmas, okay? Because I don't know what you did with the one you have, but that one's too big. I got some big ones too. He kind of goes back and forth between the two. And then I got um, these for my sister. She eats them for breakfast. She is currently in school, but I'm the best babysitter ever. So I'm gonna buy you the snacks you like, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? First of all, why does Martin's potato bread cost $4.59? For a loaf of bread are you freaking kidding me like joe biden i'm gonna say it once again for the people in the back that's not really listening too well why is the price of everything going up except for how much i get paid i'm just saying how am i supposed to afford my lifestyle if everything is up by 85 percent? but anyways i went to the dollar store um i went in there for a paintbrush I left with a paintbrush. I was shocked that they had everything that was on my list. I kind of thought that was gonna, they wasn't going to have nothing, but they had everything. Um, I got some Swiffer wet jet thing because I'm running low because Enzo has figured out how to press the button. He has Matter of fact, if I have the video still on my phone, I'll put it right here. He has figured out how to press the button on a Swiffer. He thinks it's freaking hilarious, so now there's no stuff in it. So I had to buy some more. Um, I got some hefty trash bags. I'm hoping these are like the... He's under the chair. Enzo, what are you doing? 
He's like, y'all had me in a stroller all day yesterday. I'm at a fool today. Um, I'm hoping these are like the super big ones so that I can put like three in my suitcase. They're gonna be like, what is this girl doing? Um, these aren't super cute, are they? They'll do, but I wanna put like a couple of these in my suitcase so that I could put like the balloons in them the night before when I inflate them so that I'm not doing it like a crazy person the day of, of her birthday and I don't disappear for hours. So I'm gonna put like four in there just for shits and giggles, you know? It's not gonna add any weight to my suitcase. Matter of fact, I'm gonna make it five. I'm gonna make it five. Um, so yeah, I bought those for that. These were $10. I don't know what dollar store sells trash bags for $10 but I paid $10. So yeah, I got those for five of them. <laughs> I bought this big pine box with 35, 30 gallon trash bags. So I could use five, but it's whatever. Um, I got some packaging tape, cause I guess ran out two seconds ago. And I saw these little candles and I thought these were super, super cute. They're silver, which is going with, along with my theme. And I got those for her cake. I also have some other candles in my house that I found. They're like pastels and pinks. So I put those in my suitcase as well. Had to get some Swiffer things. And I got a paintbrush. And my total was $43. Dollar store, count your days. Because that don't even make no sense. I could've went to Target. I could've went to Target for the vibes. And my, my total might've been less, but whatever. So, you know, I'm home now. All is well. We got everything we need, hopefully, for the day. So I'm gonna clean like the kitchen first and feed Enzo at the same time. He be serious about cleaning. Like, let me show y'all your nephew because I feel like y'all be thinking I be making things up. Why are you beating my dog up? Why are you beating my dog up? Ha ha, stuck. You need help? No, cause you were a genius. Why are you sleeping the wrong way? Oh, there you go. Wow. Thank you for helping me clean. I'm gonna get you. Why you got the dish soap? You don't even want it. You're just being bad. But yeah, I'm gonna drink some ballerina tea. I'm trying to get this stomach on flip, 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 flip. So I'm having me a cup of this for breakfast. So yeah, ooh, I'm gonna be on the toilet all day, y'all. Thank God I ain't got nowhere to go. Look at him. You hungry, huh? You trying to get your own breakfast? All right, let me feed him. Let me get him situated and I'll be right back. All right, so I finished cleaning. Thank God. First of all, I look crazy. But anyways, that wasn't what I was about to say anyways. But first of all, it is so hard to clean with um, Enzo because everything I put away, he just went behind me and threw it back down. Then, then um, you know, he loves unplugging the vacuum. And then he was grabbing the mop and the Swiffer. And I started painting the walls. Child, he walked right up to where I painted and just put his hands right in it. It like is so hard to clean with him, but he's napping now, thank goodness. And I'm sitting here doing my nails and the reason I'm doing them now is cause sometimes when I do these, they pop off. So I was like, let me just put them on now and like if they stay, that means they'll last for the vacation. If they don't, then I'll just put like regular gel polish on or maybe I'll go to the nail salon or something, I don't know. Um, but I was like, let me just kind of get it together a little bit. I don't know why my thumb is so wonky. Is it because I don't have a nail? I don't know. So I put some tips on. Um, usually I use the Gel X ones, the Prey ones. But I got these from Amazon. These are gel like soft gel tips, extra short almond. Um, they come on like a, they come on like a thing like this. And you just get the sizes you want. So I went with these because they're a little softer than the Apre ones. And I feel like sometimes the Apre ones don't stay on me because it's so hard that it doesn't mold to my nail. Like I think my nail is a little bit more curved than the natural nail. I don't know. This is just my theory. This is what I think in my mind. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Super, super easy. Lemon squeezy. You know what I'm saying? Everybody always asks how I do my nails, but I don't feel like I do anything fancy. That's why I don't show it, you know? Like feel like first of all i have paint on my t-shirt this is a pan guy t-shirt got paint on it but i use this little light it's so much better when you're doing these nails because like before oh, i gotta hear this one before 
uh, a prey came out with this one because like a prey came out with this stuff, right? And it was like this, but it was so hard to do it yourself because technically this was made for you, like if you work in a nail salon. So it was so hard to get this set right with this. And then Kiera Sky came out with one, and their light is good too. This this, why is this light under my table? Because it ends up this one looks like this, and it's basically the same thing as this. Um, but I don't know, I don't remember why I don't like this one. I don't think there was nothing wrong with this one. I think you had to press the button with each use or something. I don't freaking, I don't remember. But this one from Amazon, which is cheaper than all of them, and from Beatles, it just turns on by itself, like as soon as you put your finger under it. That's why Amazon is the plug, because they got everything, okay? So yeah, you just prep your nails as usual, and then you put like nail glue. It looks like this, not like actual nail glue. Well, I don't know why this camera doesn't focus anymore, but it's killing me. It looks like this. Um, and then crack my eyeball. Thank you so much. You put like a thin layer of that on all your nails and then you cure it. I do have like a whole entire nail kit just if you're like, what the hell, Asia? I just don't like going to the nail salon and because I like pick my nails so much naturally, it was like the biggest waste of money. And then when I would go to the nail salon sometimes and get like sets that cost like a hundred dollars or something, like full sets, I always found something wrong with them. So I just don't like going to the nail salon. When I go to my aunt's nail salon though in West Philly Beauty and Co, I like I've never had a problem there. Um it's just they're always booked. So I was like, I know for sure I'm not getting an appointment for my vacation. Like when I tell you my aunt's salon be booked the hell up, rightfully so, because it's so cute in there and everybody does amazing work and like shout out to her. But Y'all know I'm last minute, so like I don't schedule my appointments like a month in advance. I schedule my appointments the week of. So that wasn't happening. So I was like, let me see if I can make it work. But I think these ones are going to stay. I don't know why the prey ones just be like popping right off like in its entirety. But like if I do them on somebody else, they last. I don't know. But I'm hoping that these will just stay on. I probably won't even paint them yet. Um, and I'm hoping they just stay on. And then like Thursday, I'll kind of put some designs or something. But on Thursday, my aunt is coming over here to do my eyelashes. She used to do nails as well. It's a different aunt. Maybe I could get her to put me like a little design or something. Is that asking for too much? She's not going to say no to me because she loves me. I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. The hardest part I feel like about putting on these nails is making sure they're not crooked. I actually did really good today. But sometimes I think it's my fingers that are crooked and not my nails. It's just me. No? Okay. Um, but yeah, I just came out here to give you guys an update on my life. I'm starving. I drank a whole cup of the poopy tea. I call it the poopy tea, but I ain't poop yet. TMI. Didn't poop yet, but I drank the whole cup with two tea bags, and it says use one. But I'm trying not to have no shadow on vacation. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be snatched. Um, ooh, I got a piece of hair in my life. So let me put this like this. Press it and then we're gonna glue it. Why was I just like, why do I look so crazy? Like, why does my hair look like this? I forgot that when I showered last night, I just got right in the bed. <laughs> I like towel dried it, didn't even brush it. And this is what she's left looking like. Yes, I know, right? I look crazy. Say, hey, mommy, fix your hair, mommy. Um, So yeah, I got to get this together. But the guy's back up, as you can tell. I did finish though. Um, I didn't put any polish on them yet just because I don't know what I want to do. I don't know if I want to go plain and classy. I don't know if I want to do a design. I don't know. Don't do that. That wrapping paper has glitter on it. Um, so before I go get her from school. I might as well like start rapping to his bark. I'm so stupid. What is this? Not what I 
I was waiting for. Where's my other Amazon packages? Oh, I feel like Amazon be playing with my emotions because now arriving 1.15 to 4.15 p.m. I be like trying to make sure that's the thing about vlogmas I try to make sure like it's something Christmassy included in each video but like that's kind of hard because like on a day-to-day -day basis I'm not over here acting like I'm at the North Pole you know like I'm in Philly it's just living my normal life so yeah I don't know I don't know I think today's vlog we're just gonna finish doing like our DIY projects for the trip my airpods the cake topper What else did I have to do? I don't know. But anyways, let me show you guys what I got from Amazon. So originally it was supposed to be like this big couple strip. What? It was supposed to be not the battery guy. I'm scared to turn this on. Um why is it not on? Does it need batteries? Amazon, don't send me sending these batteries. Oh, it does need batteries. And it needs a nine volt. I don't have no nine volt battery, but anyways, um, before this dies, I picked this up from Amazon. It's a door stopper. It was supposed to be a couple's trip, but then Jalen and her boyfriend backed out. And I was like, well, I might as well not take my date. You know, I might as well not take my me and my sneaky link or whatever. Um, so it's just going to be me, Steph, and her boyfriend, which is fine because I tell you guys all the time they were all friends. Anyways, so I started getting the heebie-jeebies about staying in a hotel room by myself. And I was like, ooh, I'm kind of scared. I was like, I don't know. So I picked up a couple precautionary measures, safety precautions. Sometimes I can't, I can't talk. But anyways, I picked up this door stopper. You put it in the door and you put a battery in it and you put it on like high, low, medium sensitivity. And what happens is, is when the door tries to open and it hits this, this goes down and it sets an alarm off. <laughs> all right, so. All right, so we got the harp from school and I'm about to do these little cricket projects really quickly. Um, and then like cook dinner and stuff. And then I'll probably be it for today for the vlog because... I feel like I've been doing things nonstop, which I have, but after I eat dinner, we'll cook them dinner. I'm going to take it easy and kind of figure out what I need to do in order to prep for vacation. So from Amazon after earlier, I ordered these little cake toppers. They're quite big. I think they're like, I don't remember the size. I don't remember the number, but they're big. As you guys see, they're the size of my face. The reason I ordered these cake toppers off of Amazon is because I ordered her cake um, in... Like, the bakery did cute stuff, but I wanted it to be, like, a little bit more modern. So, yeah. And I picked a cake that I liked. Like, that was just, you know, like, good enough for where we were going. Um, and I was like, I'll just make a nice cake topper. So, yeah. The first thing's first when it comes to, like, doing Cricut products. And I'm also going to do my AirPod case, too. Is usually, like, I don't think you have to do it this way, but this is how I do it. So, like, I hold it up on the grid of where, it's like, you cut the vinyl. And I see how big it is. So... It's basically, it's five by five. So like, what is it, the circumference? Uh, <laughs> um, so I'm gonna figure out what I wanna type. I wanna see, can I turn you guys this way so you guys can see my computer as well and not so much of me? So once you open the Cricut uh, design space, this is what your kind of like design, what you want. So I don't know if I should put happy birthday Steph, happy 30th birthday Steph or Steph's 30-30. I think I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna do happy 30th birthday stuff. Cause I also made these. Um, can you guys see this? Let me see, let me see. So once we're in the Cricut design space, I'm gonna click text and I'm gonna type out everything first. Uh, that's not how you spell Asia. Happy 30th birthday. Should I put her whole name? Let's try her whole name first before we put Steph even though she said she prefers Steph but how are you gonna prefer a nickname over your real name the people want to know all right so um, this is essentially five across but I think for the sake of like the circle itself so that it's like centered I'm thinking I'm gonna do like just over four like maybe like four and a half vibes um which is mm, I don't want it to be like too big, but I also don't want it to be too small, you know? So if it goes five, I think that should be good enough. Okay, so now we gotta select a font. I usually use the fonts that I downloaded on my computer rather than like, cause these ones are like on the Cricut itself or the Cricut design space. And then you could 
use like the free ones and then there's ones that are like you buy and cricket is a scam shut up Maybe I'll do it this way so i can have is that better for you guys cricket is a scam low-key because everything costs like two dollars and it doesn't even be anything that serious so like let's see if there's any fun i must have bought this fun which i don't recall but hey who am i let's see see there's not that many free ones so let's go to what's on my computer let's see if we like it in capital letters maybe that's what's bothering me what was that harper Of course it was. Yeah, I don't like that either. It should be in cursive somewhat. Uh, do we want happy birthday, Steph? Or happy birthday, Stephanie? Um, I don't like the way that looks. All right, so I think I'm going to do something plain and straightforward like this because I don't want to like do too much and it's too busy because like the cake is like ombre and has like some roses. <laughs> what the hell was that anyways um so yeah this is the same font as the cups anyways like i prefer it to be cohesive anyway so it's kaoli and auto rich and then i just put some hearts on it from um cricket itself and then i'm just going to group it all together and like attach it so it's one little piece um and then that i have i have the hearts to five but that's because i'm going to cut them out and probably put them separately so now we have the pink placed so now i need to put some white I put the white at the number five. And I'm literally just gonna put like the smallest little square because it doesn't need to be big. Um, but I'm gonna just plop that from the number five down so that I could cut the second layer of my initials. And we're gonna feed the grip board in. Once you press make on your computer, it'll connect. Mine's is connected via Bluetooth because I have no idea where the cord is. Um, and then it starts to light up the buttons over here. It's on cardstock. Why is it on cardstock? Let's put it on vinyl. Um, press the little arrow. Oh, I didn't even put my new blade in. No, wait. Hold on. And she gets to making. of angles um all right so once it's done printing i don't know where my weeding tool is so i'm gonna use oh matter of fact heart can you do me a favor got it and then i'm gonna show you guys the downwards angle so we have the white and then we have the pink i'm gonna do the pink on top of the white so that way it's more noticeable on the um airpod case you could also do this the opposite way i'm doing it which is like put the while you're on the airpod case and then just put the pink on top but i like to make the uh whole layering process at once I don't... that wasn't centered For the cake topper, I placed it on top of the grip so I could use like the back um, the back grid as my guidelines to make something straight. That way nothing's crooked. So we're gonna go in with happy first. I cut everything separate so that, um, I don't know, so I could like see if I wanna place something closer or farther apart depending on the, um, what do they call it? Depending on, oh, depending on the uh, circle. It did move a little bit, but that's okay. And then this is going to go... I think I'm going to put this... Dang. It did move a little bit when I put it on there. God darn it. I'm just going to... And then we're going to go in with her name. There's the dog making his cameo. Come 
<laughs> Alright, so I finally finished my project. I had to redo the cake topper because the perfectionist in me, it wasn't letting me let it be crooked. But I still am not 100% with it, but it is what it is. I right. I got stuff to do today. So this is how it came out. Super, super cute though. Happy birthday, Stephanie! Boo! So yeah, I'm going to bring this with me, plop it on a cake. I'm going to wash it um, and put it in a Ziploc bag so that it's clean. And then this is how the AirPod case came out. Super, super cute as well so oh, the guy's here now you don't gotta push me to tell me that you want it just say please did y'all see him shove me he just pushed me like hello say please please you're welcome you may know say thank you um i'm about to cook some dinner for the kitties i'm gonna just make the baked spaghetti from tiktok because they seem to think they're supposed to have it once a month but yeah, should I montage me cooking? I'll probably montage it. So let's cook some dinner. I'm so tired. I had a long day. I'm ready to I'm ready to go to sleep. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm about to go to bed. I'm literally locking the house up, making sure everything's clean. Just got finished washing the dishes. So this day of vlogmas has come to an end. I have done all my little creative projects, my little task. I don't even know what else I did today. But I'm pooped. I'm so tired today. I literally, like, right here, ooh, the tension is building up. Tomorrow, I'm dedicating my day to packing because I really need to pack. So, yeah, I'm so tired today. I didn't even turn on the Christmas trees, not even once. That's how you know. That's how you know when you're sleepy. So, I'm going to get in bed. I'm about to start editing Vlogmas. That way, we can keep it moving, you know, keep the momentum going. I will see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas Day. Is it four? Maybe something like that. But I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks so much for watching so far. Oh God, I'm so tired. My back is killing me. I will see you guys tomorrow because my shoulder blades is on fire.